Did you know the science for the calorie deficit diet is 129 years old? The original scientific research that still underpins the idea of calories in versus calories out was completed in 1896 by a man by the name of Wilbur Atwater. And using the science of the day, he very cleverly calculated that carbohydrates per gram contain four calories, protein per gram, four calories, and fat, nine calories per gram. And that, I believe, is where we get the idea that fat is fattening from. Because in the 1950s, when people were starting to become overweight due to post-war abundance, they needed some advice to give people some science. And we revert back to this original idea of energy in versus energy out. But importantly, there's been a huge amount of scientific research separate to energy in versus energy out to understand the human metabolism since 1896. For example, insulin wasn't discovered until 1912, estrogen in 1923, cortisol and progesterone in 1930, testosterone 1935, inflammatory cytokines 1956, visceral fat wasn't discovered until 1980. And all of these things have a huge effect on how our body regulates weight. So if you want a more scientific approach to weight loss, understanding all of the different factors, give me a follow.